How's it going lads, Phil Potter here and welcome to the fourth episode of Road to a Better Bollocks FC. I have let you down once again. It's been two weeks since my last video after I said I was trying to get a video out once a week. I'm a complete and utter disgrace. If you don't know where I've been, check out my last video. That'll give you all the nitty gritty details. But I need a hand from you here, okay? If you could give me a little bit of help on this, I will love you forever, okay? I need a new team and I have no idea what the market is like anymore. I've no idea what kind of informs are out. So if you've got any good suggestions, let me know in the comments below and I'll, I'll build a team. And then I promise you, I will get a video out on Friday. That is uh, my promise to you. <laughs> but anyway, let's just get into this episode now, okay? We're coming up against a team with absolutely pathetic chemistry. And let me tell you, this man, Ricardo Caresma, is unbelievable. This guy, every time I use him in FIFA, it's like, I suppose this is the way I'll put it, okay? You know those double barrel names? You've got like Taylor Fletcher and stuff like that. Well, Charisma, if his double barrel name was Charisma Balls, that, that would be perfect because every time I use him, it's like someone is caressing my balls. I would have to say it would make FIFA a lot more entertaining as well. But look at the state of this. It's absolutely ridiculous. Hang on. Do you hear that? Oh, here we go. Is right we do like big booty bitches and so does charisma as you can see what an incredible goal uh, i'm sure you're able to tell from the title of this video that i was gonna score a screamer and hopefully i deliver that was my best goal of fifa so far although it's not hard i've only played about 10 games like but anyway that was it for the game actually there nothing else happened in the second half and this is what charisma had to say about the goal see thank you thank you well yes this goal make me feel like Freshly shaven pair of bollocks. I'm very happy. I'm very happy today. <laughs> I swear to you, that was not edited. There was no editing in that. That was an actual interview with Charisma. Uh, but anyway, into the next game we go. And it's an alright looking team. Not too scary at all. Money in. A uh, bit of Spanish and then Tim Howard in goal, just for the bit of beard, of course. Now, look at this. This guy pauses it as he's going through on goal. What that That is like uh, someone saying, here, I'll give you a race to the end of the road and back. And whoever wins gets Ariana Grande. But then someone at the start of the race kicks you and you trip. And then the other person gets Ariana Grande. That's what that was like. And I can see the goal 1-0 down. And then, mmm, titties. <laughs> I mean, um titty gives away a penalty. Uh, and yeah, this is just an absolute disgrace. What was he thinking? But at least my goalkeeper is an absolute genius. And look at this. <laughs> what the... That's, now that's bollocks. Uh, let my keeper save that. What? <laughs> that is just cruel. But of course, once you give the ball to Ricardo Cresma, there's only one thing happening, and we had a goal on the score sheet. Lovely jubbly. And then in the 24th minute, the. Oh my god. Oh, this is just juicy now. It's like Tropicana orange juice. I, I hope you all love that because it is delicious. We're all over this guy. Look at those stats. 61% possession. This is, you know, this is a bit of a destruction here. And we break through with Ricardo Caresma again. And usually everything he touches turns to gold. But that, that right there... If you would consider that goal, it would be gold covered in dog shit or something because that goal was absolutely terrible. But, you know, I'll take it. We're back on, back in it. Two all. And here is El Yanusi. Now, this here is delicious. Oh, my God. What? He took out two players of that. Let's have a replay here. Enjoy your trip, lads. <laughs> uh, see you next fall. Oh, oh God. Yeah, I bet you've never heard them jokes before. But we'll continue on anyway. And look at this football. This football is absolutely delicious. We swing the ball in. And Abdelawi is a bit of a lunatic, I have to say. He's, he's got this incredible sense of humor. He scores a goal with his head. And he starts pointing at his leg. I tell you, the lunacy is just absolutely outrageous. What a tackle from my defender there. Holy shit. And the counter... Oh, my God. Oh, God, this football is so delicious. I'm not going to lie. Abdelawi breaks through. And, of course, he's going to finish that. There's no doubt about it. The little cheeky chip over the keeper. And we win the game 5-2. You, you know, unstoppable. 
is what that is, you know what I mean? I'm really struggling here. I still have to get my mojo back in terms of commentary, but I'm, I'm doing okay. This is all in one take so far, so let's keep going. I'm not gonna lie, lads, I'm into my second take now. That did not take me long to fluff that after I was so happy with myself a second ago. But anyway, we go into this next game here and li listen straight away, take it away, Martin Tyler. Sweaty time. Jesus, I said his name extremely strangely there, I have to say, but it doesn't matter, we're down one absolutely good with that because it's a filthy goal but Elianusi is just he's a delicious little plonker <laughs> what? I don't even know what, what these words are coming out of my mouth but the keeper saves that he plays it straight across to Maxime and we're, we're back on track straight away and now I have to say Griezmann here you know what I mean? This is just unbelievable. That, that's a delicious delivery. That's like it's as delicious as like, nipples with Nutella smeared all over them. And uh, let me tell you something: it doesn't get much more delicious than that. Well, big Willie Carvalho wins us a penalty in the 32nd minute. A little bit of a dive, I have to say. But here's his favorite tune. Oh, okay. Getting a bit carried away with myself there. No, I've only messed Let's continue anyway. He's had two shots. He's scored two goals. I'm feeling fairly confident. Look at those stats. There's only one man who's going to win this game. Am I right, lads? Antoine Griezmann breaks through. And oh my goodness. In the 60th minute, I couldn't believe it. What a kick in the teeth. But in the 83rd minute, we get another chance here. Maxime with a lovely ball through to Elianusi. He's not going to miss this. Oh, 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 Jesus. <laughs> Referee. What is going on there? Look at that. How is that not a penalty? Uh, a red card and a death sentence. That was absolutely disgusting. Uh, but that's it for today's episode, lads. It seems nice, short and sweet. Uh, but like I said earlier, if you have any suggestions for teams, let me know in the description below and uh, I will get a video out on Friday. I can promise you that, okay? I promise you. Um, other than that, I hope you did enjoy the episode. If you did, leave a like. If you didn't, then uh, just fuck off. <laughs> no, I'm only messing. Uh, uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, other than that, talk to you again soon, lads. Have a good one. And always remember that. I take you to the candy shop. Oh Jesus, that's the wrong tune. Hang on, hang on. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving you. Oh baby. Go on lads, talk to you soon.